A variation on a man's tuxedo is worn by Miss New Mexico, Mae Shanley, who is joined by Julie Murdoch, Miss Oklahoma. And now, Miss New Mexico! Two names. All right, Miss New Mexico. She is May Shanley. May is 21. She lives in Almogorda, New Mexico. And she attends New Mexico State University. And Miss New Mexico, what do you study? I'm still studying elementary education. And where would you like, you want to teach? Yes, I would like to teach. I'd like to teach in DOD schools. And they're the schools that I grew up. Department of Defense schools in Europe and Asia, military dependent schools. These are our schools on military bases? Military bases. That way, I don't have to speak another language. So, <laughs> you see, these uh, beauty delegates are always thinking. They're not just beautiful. They're always thinking. Now, Miss New Mexico, are you from a military family? Yes, my father's a chief master sergeant in the United States Air Force, and he immigrated from I Ireland 25 years ago. And this truly speaks for itself, because I can just really say there's no place like home, and this is my home, the United States of America. And, yes. This would also, this would also explain your ancestral background, wouldn't it? Your mother is Taiwanese. Yes, my mother's from Taiwan, my mother's Chinese, and my father's Irish. And so it, sometimes I, I really think that life is left up to fate because my parents, I don't think if they ever thought about it, that they'd ever get married, but somehow they did, and we, they brought us to a new land, and, and I'm really happy for that. Now, if they're sitting at home watching, I'll bet they're thinking, we thought about it, we wanted to get married. <laughs> well, let me tell you, Mom and Dad, you did a good thing. <laughs> yes, you certainly did. You tell your dad hi, tell your mom sayonara. Thank you. A score now on your screen at home, but only for you. And Miss... Miss New Mexico. is five feet seven inches tall and weighs 117 pounds. She has dark brown eyes and dark brown hair. Miss Missouri, Miss New Mexico. pick up the computer results that will tell us who our five finalists are. And once again, the composite score for each of our finalists will be shown to you at home as she's announced. Now, may I have the computer results, please? The names of the five finalists, one of whom will become Miss USA 1984. Good luck to all ten of you. Here we go with the names of the five finalists. The first name on the list is Miss New Mexico. We'll see her composite score as I call Miss New Mexico. Would you step out to me, please? Miss New Mexico, the question is, if you are chosen Miss USA, you'll be a Miss Universe contestant. What would you most want to tell the other contestants about your home country, the USA? Well, I would stress this is the land of the free. Having two parents who are from completely opposite parts of the world, my mother's from Taiwan, as I said, and my father's from Ireland, I know how good it is to be in the United States because I've experienced all types of life, and I realize that this is most important, to represent your country to the very best of your ability. And no matter what country you're from, make it the best and make sure that you're proud of it. 
Thank you, Miss New Mexico. The judges are still evaluating our five finalists. As a help to them, we're going to treat everyone to a close-up look at the loveliness of our contestants. The judges have monitors so that they, like you there at home, can see close-ups of our five finalists. To the perfect combination of pretty ladies and pretty music is added the musical excitement of Neil Sedaka. become Miss USA and the other will be the first runner-up. The first runner-up, of course, is a very important position because if for any reason Miss USA cannot fulfill her obligation for the entire year, the first runner-up becomes Miss USA. Now I shall read the first runner-up and then Miss USA. The first runner-up is Miss West Virginia and Miss USA is Miss New Mexico. Congratulations, Faye. awards and all the magnificent prizes are yours. Also the chance to be our country's representative in Miami, Florida for the Miss Universe pageant on July 9th. Now as your predecessor, Julie Hayek, reads the Miss USA Creed, you step right out there and show everyone how happy you are to be our new Miss USA. pageant in order to further the cause of peace, justice, and mutual understanding, we solemnly dedicate ourselves to the highest ideals of sportsmanship, friendship, and goodwill among all the people in the United States. 21-year-old May Shanley from Almagorda, New Mexico is the new Miss USA. She is currently a student at New Mexico State University a career in elementary education. She's five feet seven inches tall and weighs 117 pounds. She has brown eyes and dark brown hair. May's hobbies include singing, acting, and dancing. Congratulations, May. And now, on behalf of all of us associated with the pageant and on behalf of our new Miss USA, this is Bob Barker saying good night, everyone. Well, tonight in Lakeland, Florida, Cinderella's name is May Shanley, and May Shanley's new name is Miss USA. We'll see her and hopefully you again on the night of July 9th when she represents the United States in the Miss Universe pageant to be telecast live from Miami, Florida on CBS. Until then, and another magic evening, thank you all, and good night. Portions of this program were pre-recorded.